So this video is sponsored by Electronic Arts. So what is going on guys? Welcome back to another Plants vs Zombies 2 Battles video here today on my channel. Today we're going to be showcasing a brand new Power Mint and the Power Mint we're going to be showcasing today is the Peppermint. Now the Peppermint is going to be buffing all of your fire plants when you place it down on the board. But also, as you can probably tell when you load the game up, the Lawn of Doom event is also live in Plants vs Zombies 2 and it's going to be powering up two Lawn of Doom plants as well. Those plants are the Jack-O-Lantern and the Ghost Pepper. Now I think the Ghost Pepper and the Jack-O-Lantern not only look amazing, but are very powerful when you use them in game. And being able to buff them with the Peppermint is gonna make them even more powerful. So it's a perfect time for the Peppermint to be released at the same time as the Lawn of Doom event. So in total, the Peppermint is going to be powering up a total of 10 plants in its family. You can see them all on screen right now. You can go into the Almanac if you wanna go check check them all out for yourself or if you are deciding on which plants you want to choose in game you can find out which plants are going to be affected by the little flame symbol they have in the top left hand corner. Now my go to plant instantly in this family is the fire pea shooter. I've always liked the fire pea shooter. I think it's a very powerful plant. I love its plant food ability and I also love the fact that it can defrost surrounding plants around the fire pea shooter if they do get frozen. However, if you don't have the fire pea shooter, you can combine a normal pea shooter with the torchwood and hey presto, you've got yourself some fire peas and the torchwood will also be buffed by the peppermint as well, making it even more powerful when the peppermint is down on the board. Now as you know, once you do use a power mint and you place it down on the board, it has some kind of an instant effect. It does either some kind of damage or some special effect and I really love the peppermint because it actually puts a huge burst of flames on every single lane on the board which deals a massive amount of damage. This lasts for a couple of seconds and then after the flames disappear, the peppermint is still going to remain on the board and still power up your other plant in that family. So it has an instant effect which lasts for a few seconds and the remaining time on the board it's still going to power up your fire plants. So to demonstrate how powerful the peppermints can be, I'm not going to be using any plants on screen right now. I'm just going to use the peppermint and look how many zombies are taken out just from the instant effect of placing the peppermint down on the board. That's how effective the instant ability is, not to mention your plants are going to be buffed as well. So that's a brief overview of everything you need to know about the peppermint. It's definitely one of my favorites, if not my favorite peppermint in the game. I just love the instant effect. That's the Main thing what sells it for me and I actually really like my fire plants anyway in Plants vs Zombies 2. It's a really good mint, hopefully you guys enjoy it as well. If you want to check out some of my other power mint videos you can click one of the videos on screen right now and make sure you do subscribe if you are new to the channel. Thank you very much for watching, my name is Zero and hopefully I will catch you guys in my next video.